Hundreds of thousands of visitors are expected here in Northeast Ohio for next month's total solar eclipse. And we've been following through with stories that affect you and your community. Trying to keep you up to date here tonight. News 5 anchor Tracy Carlos takes us east to Lake County to see how they're getting ready for all of this and why first responders are concerned and the message that they want to spread. The sun is shining. Birds are chirping. A picturesque day on the shores of Lake Erie. Tammy Emas comes to the lake often. Oh yeah, it's our greatest treasure here. But on April 8th, the day of the solar eclipse, the shores of Lake Erie here in Northeast Ohio will look different. A lot more people are expected. In those areas that the population has doubled, certainly for two to three days. Lake County Sheriff Frank Leon Bruto told me they have been in contact with law enforcement agencies in cities that have been in the path of totality before. Some places that it would take you a half hour to travel to a destination took six to eight hours. Because of the potential traffic, the sheriff told me most schools will be closed. Most court cases are canceled. More dispatchers will be working and staffing of first responders will be beefed up for accidents and medical emergencies. But that's not all that he's concerned about. That um, people want to do us harm, use an event like this where a lot of people are gathered to do some type of terror event. The director of the Lake County Emergency Management Agency told me they've been preparing for the solar eclipse now for about two years. We've done everything we can to prepare for it. Joe Busher told me they've been working with dozens of agencies and businesses all across Lake County. At our last meeting, there was 20, about 20 organizations present, everything from public safety to the Council of Aging. We talked to them about um, Meals on Wheels. They're actually gonna give uh, Friday a cold meal just in case they can't get delivery on, on Monday. Emergency management officials and first responders are reminding residents to be prepared. They say they want that message out. They say prepare, for example, like a snowstorm is coming. In Lake County, Tracy Carlos, News 5. So part of the preparation may be staying home. If you do, we'll bring you live coverage from start to finish. And if you're going somewhere, make sure you download our News 5 app and watch our coverage as the eclipse works its way to you. And if you want to be in a crowd and you're looking for a place to watch, join us at Avon Lake Memorial Stadium. We'll be there at exclusive station broadcasting there for you. You can check out all the details on our website.